Hello everyone, it's Sandra Lemming here and I would like to today show you a short tip on how to contact your member services department uh, or support in your SFM dashboard if your speech bubble has gone. So as you can see mine is still here. Um, so I can click on that and I can use uh, chat and I can put my questions in there and wait for support to contact me back. And as you can see, I've got two messages in there. So if I was to click on that, it would show me those two messages, which would possibly be SFM notifications. Now, if you happen to log into your SFM dashboard and you see no chat bubble down here, it's missing, it's gone, it won't show up. Even if you scroll like this, it won't show up and you click around it still doesn't show up because sometimes if it's not there, if you scroll and you just click in the in the darkness here, it'll show up. Uh, but if it's not showing up for you, what you can do is up here in your dashboard, you have tabs. This is just like a website. And if you scroll over your tabs, you've got different things that you can look at, you can go to, you can find. Okay, so what you can do if you want to contact support and your support bubble is missing, come up to your tabs, your, your SFM dashboard tabs, scroll over support, click on support, and just let that next page load. Now once that page loads, you'll have some information here um, that you can read. Uh, you can read about member services um, and a little bit about what we, what we do for you. And uh, you have a yellow button to contact member services just here uh, and as you can see you can still scroll on this page like you can any other page um, now you can also uh, check out what you need to do to get to the private community the SFM private community here so you can click here and you can read about the SFM private community uh, and you can access the private community through this button here but you must need to have joined the SFM community which will mean you'll need to be cleared by the administrator uh, when you first set up your account. Uh, you've got uh, member FAQs here, uh, so you can find some questions and answers about the SFM that you can go to and, and go through and read about. Okay, uh, you've also got some feedback and some testimonials. But if you're in need of contacting support and your bubble, your contact bubble down there for to get into chat is not opened, come into your support tab, click on that, it will open up to the contact us page and what you can do there is then you can click on this yellow box, contact member services and what will happen is your chat area will open up here and you can read any old um, no notifications that you haven't read. So I haven't read these couple of notifications these are SFM notifications. They can be very helpful to you, very important. Um, can give you points and tips and links to webinars. So, you know, don't ignore your notifications. Give them a read if you haven't been reading them in your emails. It'll tell you how many more you have left. Um, as you can see, I can click on this and I can expand it and make it bigger and I can read it through here. And I can even scroll down and read all my notifications. So I can start submit feedback and everything through here. You see, I can go through all my notifications here. I can listen to Frank and Jill's uh, happy podcast through my notifications. All great stuff. So very easy to do. And then you can just click off of that and you, your little box will still be here. Um, and now if you, you come here and you're thinking, now how do I contact member services? And you can even give that a thumbs up or, you know, the a cheer like you know click on one of these down here and, and that'll add it to the notification but if you want to get back and you want to contact member services just click the back arrow which will show up there and then click on new conversation and then it will show you who's in member services and you can click down here and you can create a new conversation and you can um, you know whatever question you have you can type it in there and it'll show up down the bottom there
Now, I hope I spelt that correctly. No, I haven't spelt that correctly. I spelled it incorrectly. There we go. So I can now click on that and I can right click and I can spell the word properly. Um, you might not be able to do that with a Mac. I don't know. I'm using a Windows. You can click on the uh, little um, emoticon here and you can give them a, uh, you know, a happy face if you want. Oops, I've put it in the middle of the word. We don't want to do that. But uh, you get the picture. You get, you get the idea um, what you can do here. Uh, and how to get a hold of uh, member services from your um, USFM dashboard. Well, I hope that's been helpful for you. Uh, if you have any questions, just uh, put them underneath the video and uh, and I'll get back to you and answer your questions uh, as soon as I can. Or, uh, you know, uh, if you need uh, help with your SFM dashboard, anything to do with your dashboard, any questions that you may have about the system, come to your support tab uh, into your member services page and get some help. Put your question in here and we'll do our best to answer it. Okay, have a great day. Bye for now.